So, that one particular illness that's been spreading around the world that probably will get me demonetized if I mention it, it has another victim. And it's a big one this time, guys. E3. E3 has announced that they have canceled their plans to do their annual event. And talk about huge news because there's been an E3 every year since 1996. But can it recover? I would say probably not. It'd be really unlikely at this point because a lot of companies, they view the power of the internet now being able to live stream directly to the consumer gamers out there like myself and you guys and anybody else that's not watching this video and they have the ability to go directly to us they don't have to spend a lot of money trying to put on these huge ex exhibits and all this other stuff you know so will anybody really miss e3 you know i mean I know that a lot of people like going to the event and seeing everything, but you get those people trying to play those demos and lining up for three hours to play a taste of a certain game and all this other stuff. And it's, you know, it's such a hassle when nowadays they can just make everything available digitally. They can live stream the event. They can, you know, provide maybe playable demos off of PlayStation Network, Xbox Live, Steam, so on. And that's all they got to do nowadays, you know I mean? They can do everything digitally, all in the comfort of our living rooms. And when it comes to these kinds of trade shows, it's really not much of a point anymore because any kind of partnerships that these companies might make, for example, they can do it over the phone, they can do conference calls over Skype and all this other stuff. You know, they have tons of other ways that they can communicate together, email chains and all that good stuff, so kind of sucks not having an E3, but I mean, is it really going to be worse off for us in 2020 as far as spreading the gaming hype? No, it's not. They have plenty of ways that they could still do that. and So it is what it is, I guess. Let me know what you guys think. Are you going to miss E3 or do you really even care? I don't. So down Phoenix out.